I think the divide, the gap between the two big sports and the third and fourth sports in this country has grown dramatically. NHL the baseball and the NFL have taken off and left in the last five years. NHL, Mike, has never done great, though. The NHL still does good with their buildings are still sold out. and Some of them. You know, I, look, I, mean, I mean, look at Memphis. I mean, you can't get in. Memphis is terrible in the NBA. Look at New Orleans. New Orleans is terrible in the NBA. As far as attendance goes. Yeah, well, listen, the NHL's always done a little better in attendance, and, if, uh, and the NBA's always done a little better on TV. That's the way it's always the, been. Yeah. The NBA internationally, they do a great job marketing. Domestically, you're right. Stern has really just took the NBA from um, regular TV. Brought it yeah, to, he did a terrible yeah, job. He did a terrible job. Yeah, yeah I mean, sure that up. You, you, you cannot... Stern likes to fight with me and Mike all the time, but the bottom line is, from a pure interest standpoint, getting away from NBC... And splitting it up, TNT and ESPN, times of the games and everything else, was an atrocious yeah, job. There's and, no argument there whatsoever. And when the commissioners come on and tell you about how, hey, you don't know how many hits there were to NBA.com or NHL.com and how many iPod hits and this and that, you know what? That might work 20 years from now or 15 years from now. That's not really viable yet. No, I agree with I that. I mean, you're a long way. And I'm not saying that day isn't coming. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying that we'll even understand the technology 20 years from now. Because in 20 years from now, it could be something so dramatically different. Radio, but, as we know it, might not even be the same in 20 years from now. Well, but, but we're not there yet. What is, that, what is Stern saying? That uh, you can't go by the rating in the All-Star game because everybody's getting a, the, the hits on, the, on their iPods? Oh, uh, they both I'm say sure that. I'm sure they say that, but they, it's oh, they, they say that they get NHL.com, NBA.com, iPod hits, you know, hits to the phone and all this. Stuff. Hey, that is still small samplings at this time. Now, I, I, you are way, he's away from making that to be a viable way of doing business. Uh, bottom line is, is that Stern took every... And listen, Seelig did it to a degree, too, with the baseball and the TBS and everything else. But Stern, who had a willing and an excellent partner in NBC, who wanted to stay with this sport and do as good a job as they were doing, and he blew them off for an extra $2 now, million dollars a year per team. I mean, that is absurd when you get right down now, to it. Now, we are going away from the traditional television and radio and to the computer and to the telephone or the, you know, whatever you want to call that handheld thing that you have in your hand, whether it's an iPhone or a regular phone or a iPod, whatever you want to say it is, that transmission to that thing you have in your hand and the transmission to your computer is happening. People watch com TV on a computer yeah, now they all do. the time. Yeah. So it is, we are moving away from the traditional TV and traditional radio, but I think we're still at, good 10 to 15 years away before we can make that be the focal point of whatever we're doing. Uh, again, Mike, I mean, the, uh, to, to put your NBA conference finals on ESPN and TNT and have all the games begin at 10.30 and 11 o'clock at night and 9.15 in the finals, it's stupid. That's all there is to it. I mean, the NBA All-Star game began at 8.45 Eastern time on a Sunday night. Now, you cannot tell me that's a good marketing decision. No, what, you can't do it. What the NF, what, what, what NBC did was it cross-promoted the sport, and it gave it a home. It gave it a central NBA, home. NBA doesn't have a home yeah, right it now. it doesn't have a home, yeah. and I think that's important. Good point. On the fan back after this.